Hey y'all, I'm back with another Plan With Me video and this week I am using my Spring Blooms kit. Now, I originally wanted to use this for the first day of spring, but I was sick that week. Um, I had a terrible, terrible migraine and I just did not feel like doing much of anything. I practically did not leave my couch that week. But this is the whole kit. I'm using the full kit with all three um, of the add-ons. Well not all of them. I have one more add-on with the boxes that I didn't use, but I needed the school add-on because my kids are starting Easter break this Friday, and I wanted to have that no school um, sticker from that, and uh, let's go ahead and speed things up now. So if you're following me on Instagram, which is the same as my YouTube channel name is My Foxy Designs, you will notice that I have been posting a lot of crocheted items the um i know i've posted the uh cup cozies like crazy um i've been really on a crocheting kick here lately and um i get like that sometimes sometimes um i just want to change it up and then i'll do it for like a week or two and then um i'll stop um just kind of get it out of my system in a way and I have been really, really, really wanting to crochet. Um, again, I have all this beautiful yarn that I've gotten over the sales that I've been um, kind of stockpiling my yarn. And I've been looking at it and wanting to use it. So I thought, well, I want something new for the shop. And I've been thinking about bringing something new in for a while now and I've, I've kind of been rolling it over should I do keychains um, which I do want to do eventually um, so I will probably end up doing those in the shop as well um, not sure when that will happen but it's just something I would like to happen um, but I, I kind of been rolling around my head well what what would people like because um, I, I like small projects you know, something that's not too expensive, that kind of thing. And I thought cup cozies would be perfect. And um, I actually had a few. It's the cheaper kind. It was like, I, I guess made out of styrofoam kind of material. Um, it, you know, something that you can't really use all the time. It's not, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But it, you know what I mean, right? Those kinds. Um, but... I wanted something that would uh, last and be pretty so I thought well you know I, I'll go and see if I can't find some patterns um, for crocheting and uh, it turns out there's like a billion patterns not really but there's a lot of patterns out there and I just wanted something simple and I already know how to make flowers and hearts and stuff like that with crocheting so I thought might as well um, just get a simple cozy and then put flowers and hearts and stuff like that on them in very pretty colors i started out with pastel colors and then i decided to um because most of the yarn i have is very pastel-y <laughs> um because i tend to gravitate towards those uh, and i kind of get on a um bright color palette kick every now and then too um so i went out and bought other types of yarn that's not all pastel so I did bring in some brights and some uh, multicolored ones and I did make some just plain Jane ones you know with the multicolored yarn I just thought you know the all, just all the pretty colors would um, be enough uh, to really I the one I did keep a couple of them but the one that I really really like is just the cozy in the multicolors and uh, I will post a picture of it today um, well not today but when this comes out which is going to be Monday by the way uh, so hopefully you're viewing this on Monday so Monday I'm going to post a picture on Instagram with this cup cozy and um, I've already picked out my favorite uh, flowered one and, uh, and you know I've already showed that one and I wanted to show off this, just the simple ones because um, there's just something about simplicity that uh, I really do enjoy. Um, but yeah, I've, I'm going to have a new type of clip as well. I learned how to do a small heart because the bigger heart, hearts that I knew how to do, I felt were too big for a paper clip. But um, I did learn how to do a small heart and it's 
perfect and these uh, heart clips are you can actually see them I didn't even realize that those were in frame I'm just now realizing it after what after sitting here watching my plan with me this whole time but yeah the flowers you're getting kind of a sneak peek of what's coming into the shop but the multicolored hearts at the very top um, oh my gosh my desk is so messy I apologize for that it's kind of embarrassing but yeah those are what I'm talking about the hearts up at the top there um, they're really small and really simple to do so what I want to do with that is sell them in sets of two um, I'm not sure how much I'm going to charge because I don't know I just I, I have to figure out the uh, supply cost and uh, I need to time myself how uh, how long it takes me to whip up to because that kind of ties in to the cost so, of course I've got to pay myself for my time um, but y'all understand that uh anyway yeah i haven't really figured out the price yet but i am i do know for a fact that i am going to sell them in sets of two um as of right now you'll get two of the same one uh i don't really have multicolor yarn that complement each other if that makes sense which is why i am doing it like that maybe if i make uh, those hearts in like a solid color i will sell them in twos um that's a thought down down the road but as of right now all the hearts that I have done and I'm sitting here looking at my stash just to see if I'm correct um, but yeah they are multicolored yarn so um, but I am bringing out more flower um, clips I haven't done any more bow clips in a while I feel like I have a ton of those um, still in my stash and I kind of and I've already got a mixture of colors for my bow clip so I'm quite satisfied with uh, the quantity and the the colors that I have for my bow clips but um, so you're going to see a ton of cup cozies I haven't even shown all of the cozies I have made um, I've been kind of holding some back as a surprise for whenever I list everything out um, but all in all, I have greatly enjoyed um, crocheting the new items for the shop. I've had a lot of fun with it and um, so much fun that I kind of forgot to plan last week, which is why I didn't have a plan with me up for that week nor any Instagram pictures either because I did not plan for two weeks straight so I feel uh, when I planned this week I'm I was like oh my god I missed this so much uh, so I went two weeks without planning and which is I guess the two weeks that I kind of skipped planning was was good timing because really nothing was going on um, no appointments no anything nothing really uh so and but i have been keeping up with my orders even when i had a migraine i kept up with my orders and um someone had posted on a review saying that they um waited over a week for their stuff and that that's um weird because i, I have gotten all my orders out on time um i guess something happened with the uh, post office and unfortunately um, I can't control that and I feel bad for her because I tried to reply to her but um, I can't figure out how to do like reply in a review so if anybody knows how to do that on Etsy please let me know I have um, Ty, I have you know try to google it and I can't really get a straight answer or a clear answer um, and I know you can do that because I've seen others do it which um, I, I would like to know how to do that because I would like to respond to her saying that you know it's not my fault I'm sorry you know I can't help that um, so just know that when you do order um, I do have a uh, I, and I have to double check just to make sure I think I have a three to five or three to seven day I think it's three to seven days now um, of a shipping uh, policy M meaning that you know that's business days you don't include 
the weekend even though I technically work on the weekends myself but Etsy the way it does it it's Monday through Friday it's kind of like any like we if you order off anywhere else uh, it says business days and that means Monday through Friday but um, just in case some of you may not know that um you know uh, I wouldn't have known that if I wasn't doing a, a business or if I'd never ordered online before um, but yeah we once it's once I take it to the post office that's it I, that's I have no control um, over any of that and uh, I just feel bad that I you know I guess I could have convoed her if, well if I was in my right mind when that happened because I was I had a terrible migraine and uh, Oh gosh, it 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 was hard for me to do my orders. I I I'll be honest with that, and uh, I was extra. I was slow about getting it done. Normally, it takes me two three days tops to get a, a, an order out, but I did take my time while I was on, uh, having my migraine. Um, it was terrible, terrible time for me. Um, but I, I was taking my time just to make sure I got the orders right, cause that would I would feel awful if something um, were to happen. It would be my fault. Uh, I try my best to, um, you know, to to get those orders out uh, sooner than expected. Um, but you know, things happen. Um, obviously, a lot of things that are not not my control to do. But. Um, yeah, so I am going with a no white space look for the spread. And I didn't originally intend to do that. Um, I intended to use the flags, but I saw the boxes and they're simple, but yet beautiful. And I'm on a simplicity kick right now. The simpler, the better for me. So uh, that's why I really, really like this kit. You got a lot of simple um, graphics uh, with the wood grain and all that stuff, but you have that like touch of like like the girl and the swing and the florals and stuff like that in it. Um, so just I love this kit. Uh, so that is it. I just paired this kit with one of my um, yellow uh, floral crochet clips, and uh, I think I still have some of those. I don't think I have very many of those. Um, my mom and her friends has been ordering um, from me, not from the shop, but kind of giving me personal order or orders and things like that. So, um, yeah, that is it for this week's spread. I hope you enjoyed it, and I am so glad that I am back, and my migraine is gone, and I am ready to get back to work. That is it for this plan with me this week. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And go ahead and check out my Instagram page. That is my Foxy Designs where I post really cute plenary pictures and more. And uh, that's all. Thanks everyone for watching. Bye.